Alright guys, so as promised, I am going to show you a, another way, and I think an easier way, to fill up your cardamizers. Um, this one in particular, uh, these, these V2 cardamizers, uh, along with some other ones, actually, you can't take this part off. So the ones that I was used to dealing with are these ones right here, where you have this rubber piece that comes off, and then you can just fill down there in the cotton so I apologize if this thing isn't a uh, this camera isn't zooming or uh, focusing right but uh, I don't usually film this way so we're just gonna have to uh, roll with it so anyway um, so we're used to filling it up like that so this is something that the smoke and Joey actually showed on his on his channel he didn't do a demonstration or anything but he just sort of mentioned it so what you do is you take this rubber piece off and I'm kind of doing this all from the back here. So normally, when these when these come to you, this is actually on on here. Uh, epic fail. Um, yeah. So you have these on either ends, and you take these off, and that keeps them all fresh. So you save this rubber part, um, the one that doesn't have the the rubber in the middle. And what you're gonna do is you're just gonna drip maybe 15 to 20 drops in here. So I'm going to do 15 because I'm not really sure uh, how much these V2s hold. So let's see. Again. All right, so that's about 15 right there. Um, I'm actually using a... Uh, a Halo e-liquid right here. It's a uh, Turkish tobacco. I haven't tried this one, so I wanted to kind of test it out. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take this and you're going to put the metal side down. And you're just going to put this in here and you're going to do it slowly. So just real slow. Just press it right down in here. Alright, so that's all in there. And we're just going to clean it up a little bit. Get some of the excess juice out of there. Some of it came up from the top, but that's, uh, so I might have overfilled it a little bit. So maybe with these ones you want to do, you know, maybe 12 would have been a little bit better. Um, so, you know, right away I can, I can tell just from doing this this one time that these don't hold as many as the bloobs or the halos that I'm used to, uh, I'm used to using. Those I can get about 20, uh, maybe even up to like 22 drops in there and be totally fine. So, alright, so that's, uh, that's all cleaned up. I'm going to put this right back on this V2. And I'm going to try to vape it real quick, and we'll see what happens. Uh, like I said, this is the first time that I've I've tried filling one of these V2s. Uh, this thing just it lasted me for about a day, for anybody who's curious. I wasn't even vaping it uh, heavily all day, but it only lasted about a day, and it just went completely dry. The second one that I'm using that came out of the pack um, is already getting really disappointing. So, um, uh, right off the bat, I can say that I really like the batteries, but the cardamizers leave a lot to be desired, although I haven't tried the, the blanks, so I'm going to try those. So let's, uh, let's give this a vape real quick. Alright, so as you can see, it is working. Um, did get a little bit of juice coming out, um, just a bit, but that's because I overfilled it. So, like I said, I probably put um, maybe two, three drops too much in there. So, but let's, uh, let's try this again. All right, so uh, really, really good vapor coming off of that.